Hello, welcome back. Today I'm starting a new tutorial of neural networks in C++. I'm going to do a brief to make a brief introduction about this topic. If you are not uh, concerned about uh, the neural networks and how they work, you can uh, watch this complete video. If you if you are concerned, you can skip this. Well, an, a neural network is a simply full full connected neurons to them that that provides us a, a power a powerful tool to to make a lot of tasks. For example, uh, this is a simple ne neural network that that is fully connected. Every so every single neuron of the of this layer is connected to to all the neurons in the next layer. Well, uh, you will uh, you will be asking what is what is this nomenclature? The the first layer. Of the the first uh, group of neurons is called the the li a layer. The first layer is where where we input all the all the initial values. The the final output, the final layer, that is the the output that we we are looking for, is called the output layer. And the and the hidden layers are the the ones which 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 are which can make more complex and powerful our tool. This uh, you can use uh, as many neurons as you want. It's not predefined. Some some tasks may may require may, may require more more neurons and hidden layers than than others. I I haven't said that before, but uh, n neural ne neural networks are pretended to to copy the the human brain proce processes. The our neurons work uh, similar, no not equal as the as the neurons that we we are going to create okay uh, now we are going to see the the mathematical operations that we that are required for example in this photo is is similar to the other but uh, every every single line that connect one layer with the next represent a weight it's called the weight we can we can numerate it uh, with this nomenclature and the the previous uh, layer with this nomenclature now to obtain the next neuron value we are going to make this operation uh, weight 1 multiplied by x1 plus a weight 2 multiplied by x2 plus weight 3 multiplied by x3 and then we, we sum everyone and we introduce this value in, into a function that that we are going to see later. This function uh, are different types of, of uh, we, we have different types of, of function uh, that we want to apply. And the most important function that we are going to use is the sigmoid function. It it is representative. This graph represents very well the the function. It has a uh, a limit or a, a limit in one and two, and in this is the the function. 1 divided by 1 plus e to the x 
to the minus x power. So now we can start programming our neural network. Uh, 